Both multidisciplinary and interdisciplinary research are really important. The key differences between them include the level of integration between the disciplines. In interdisciplinary research, disciplines are integrated from the outset. Multidisciplinary research, you might typically see some disciplines taking priority over others. You might not see them all involved at the beginning of the project. I think a crucial aspect of interdisciplinarity is the different strands of research are interwoven, whereas very often in a multidisciplinary project, they may be running in parallel. Here, each of the researchers works very closely with the other, and you then develop a much closer relationship and learn new skills. What we're trying to do is to look at how different approaches, so mathematical modeling, experimental medicine, experimental biology and imaging can all be brought together to try and understand how these diseases start and then progress. So being interdisciplinary is going to make the solution or the approach more effective. It's going to help integrate different methodologies and approaches so that the solution that we come to has really incorporated all these different elements of the problem. We had a series of workshops where we looked at what we knew and what we didn't know about tall building design. And so we realised that what was needed was this coming together of structural engineering, psychology for the human experience. And we very quickly realised we also needed physiologists. And then we had to pull all of those things together to translate into future design guidance for the next generation of buildings. It was obvious from the start that this project was never going to work unless it was cross disciplines. We have weekly meetings at least so that we are continually interacting with each other and sharing information. Central document repositories where we can all see every document all the time. We've built in these structures so that we can't fail to work interdisciplinary. So we had wanted to work together in an interdisciplinary manner. And when UKRI came up with the Cross Research Council Responsive Mode Scheme, it seemed an ideal opportunity where we could advance each of the areas of science involved, as well as answering an important fundamental question. <laughs>